Jenna Alera, a well-known Christian singer, songwriter, and worship leader for children, visited SPH Lipo Village on Thursday, April 6, 2017. Students from K3 to grade 6, teachers, staff, and parents enthusiastically gathered at Gym 1 to sing, dance, and praise the Lord. This activity was one of the six days straight of Jenna's journey in Asia to minister children as God's calling for her. All the way from California, it is a privilege for SPH community to have Jenna Alera with them. Hi, I'm Jana Alira. I'm from California in the United States, and I am delighted to be here at Espeja this morning. I love children. I love music. I love leading worship. And he just kind of developed this desire between my husband and myself to create music for children. I have a good friend who was a teacher here named Rahana, and uh, she's one of my good friends at school. It's kind of been a dream of hers. And then I met some of the staff, a few of the other people in uh, leadership, and uh, God just kind of brought several different things together to bring them here today. Well, I can't wait to see the kids. I've been thinking about this and dreaming about this for months and months and months and months. So I just want to, can't wait to see them and see their faces. And they know the songs really well. I've seen that at a couple of the other places where I've been. And to hear them sing, you know, and just to join in with them and rejoice with all the teachers and, and all of the people, it's going to be, I'm anticipating, pretty joyful like a little taste of heaven. With such energy and passion for the Lord, her brief praise and worship session was indeed memorable. Jenna's popular songs such as He is God, Wanna Do Right, God's Masterpiece, It's About L-O-V-E, and many more, sung by students harmoniously and melodiously. A lot. <laughs> A lot. Your, your team was just downstairs trying to make my American uh, headset rig work with the, all, all the electricity and all that. So, I mean, there's electrical things, there's spiritual things, just preparing my heart, um, being ready with the songs that children have been preparing, the teachers have been preparing, people have been hosting me and taking care of me and feeding me, and a lot has gone into this. Oh, sure. There's uh, vocal challenges, just singing and talking for six days straight. Uh, I have a prayer team back at home that prays just for my voice, just so that I can keep going strong, um, you know, and energy and tiredness and all that. But God's given me a lot of energy. It's just one of his things. But um, sure, you know, sometimes there's, I don't get very afraid, but I just want to do a good job. And um, so on the way over, I was just praying that God would help me to, to be his vessel. And of course there were challenges, which is little nuts and bolts, but it's basically being a joy. Simple words, easily memorized sentences, and attractive choreography in her songs make God's words become easier to be grasped, especially by young children. Most of the choreographies also use sign language so everyone can enjoy worshiping God even when they are not able to speak or hear. Jenna Alera was also impressed and felt grateful for the enthusiasm of the students. All of the attendees were blessed and encouraged to praise the Lord more wholeheartedly. Let us praise Him more and more in our lives as reflected in one of Jenna Alera's songs, He is God. The one true God. There is no doubt. I'm going to shout it out. Well, they're in a great place to start and to learn where they're learning the Word of God. They have some great examples of people who have given their lives to the Lord in service. Some wonderful role models. And I just can't imagine a better place to, to grow in Christ. But to encourage them, um, press on. Even when it gets difficult, when you get out there where the world isn't as... as nice as this one and tidy to um, trust the Lord, stay in the Word, stay in fellowship, keep worshiping Him even when it's difficult, and just know that they're God's masterpiece and God has a plan for each one of them.